Mom gives birth then nurse realizes he isn't a baby. A healthy new baby is any expectant mother's hope, but one family's dream turned into a nightmare after discovering their newborn son had become the latest member of India's werewolf family. In fact, wolf boy is a rare special existence status, the number of a total of 10 in the world. This is the story of Manisha Sambhaji Rat who was looking forward to becoming a parent. Her dreams were shattered in seconds when she and her family realized that her son had also inherited the werewolf gene from her. The tot, who has not yet been named, was born with a thick layer of jet black hair covering his arms, face, legs and back, which will just get thicker as he gets older. Now his mother, who also suffers from the rare condition, says she is heartbroken her son will face the same bullying she did while she was growing up. Werewolf boy, covered in thick black hair says he is, blessed by God. The rare condition affects less than one in a billion people worldwide, and is believed to be passed down the bloodline through DNA. The five-month-old baby boy is believed to have inherited the gene from his mother Manish Sambhaji Rat's father, who also passed it on to his daughter and her siblings. The rare condition affects less than one in a billion people worldwide. Mrs. Rot, 22, from Pune in central India wed her husband Vithal, 30, in an arranged marriage last year, and were overjoyed when they learned she was expecting a son. But their happiness was short-lived after the couple, who run a small sweet stall, realized their bouncy baby boy had inherited the gene. She said, I was happy when I delivered a baby boy but when I realized he suffered the same syndrome as me I was very upset. I was shattered. I wondered if I was cursed or if I made a mistake in life and God was punishing me and my son. Mrs. Rot and her sister Savita, 30 and Savitri, 19, met with doctors in 2012 in a desperate bid to try and control the hair growth. They now use hair removal cream every four days to strip the hair from their face, but have faced brutal abuse their whole lives because of the mystery gene. There is currently no cure for the condition known as hypertrichosis universalis, more commonly referred to as werewolf syndrome. She added, I always felt disgusted when I saw myself in the mirror and now I wonder how my child will cope with the same trauma. My sisters and I were always teased and often nicknamed ghost, bear, and monkey. We were locked away because people couldn't cope with the way we looked. I only hope people will be different and kinder towards my son. To know my son will also go through the pain and suffering I went through breaks my heart. But he is my baby and I will love him unconditionally the way my mother took care of me, no matter how he looks. Although the majority of her family have been supportive, she claims her mother-in-law has been devastated by the realization. She said, my husband is very supportive and loves his son but my mother-in-law is not happy. She keeps moaning that he is not good or a beautiful baby. She says he is ugly and looks like a monkey. I feel angry and hurt but there is nothing I can do. My mother-in-law has already forced me to apply the same cream on my son but his skin is too sensitive. He is a small baby and is not ready for such creams. He cried in pain as his skin turned red. The five-month-old baby boy is believed to have inherited the gene from his grandfather. But Manisha and her husband say they are determined her son has a happy childhood and will not be bullied like she and her sisters were. She said, my only wish is that my child will grow up like a normal child. I hope he gets accepted into a school and has all the opportunities other children have. I don't want him to suffer like me and my sisters. We lived a difficult childhood and we were locked away because people couldn't cope with the way we looked. I can only hope people will be different and kinder towards my son.